Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, I'm John Lissabini, a true nerd, and welcome back to Fallout New Vegas Dust. Where you join me here, north of Good Springs in dangerous territory, but with a couple of destinations in mind. There's a little town that may well have a bar floating around down there, and in addition, Red Rock Canyon has got its hidden armory. Beyond that, there's a vault. Alright, those things could all be very, very useful indeed. If I can not be killed by a Cazador, which feels like the most likely thing that's going to happen, because it's dark, visibility is poor, and something doesn't like me. So, I suspect I'm going to get a little bit on the eaten side. Right, well I may as well just go and check out whether this Cazador is floating around nearby. I mean, I think, yeah, those tribals who I basically fed to the Cazadors are... They pretty much managed to kill off most of each other. The question is, yeah, how many more are floating around? Because there's also, yeah, I'm in the part of the map where there's a nice little green bit over here somewhere. Where they've got some, oh, vodka. Yeah, I'm a little bit um, over capacity at the minute and also an alcoholic. So I do go mad when I'm not drunk. Actually, I'm only just over capacity right now because I've just taken the strong backpack. So... I should probably find something to drop, because I'm carrying stupidly too much stuff right now. Yeah, that hatchet. Just get rid of that hatchet. There we go. Now I can actually move around while I'm not drunk. Madness. Absolute flipping madness. And there's a little town. Right. Want to have a look in here, but towns in this mod tend to be hotbeds of survivors and cannibals and... Yeah, you're 100% a person on the move. I don't know exactly who you are, mind. Bats can't detect you at this range. Fine. Let's just get a tiny bit closer. See if we can scout out how many we're looking at. Right, I got visibility. On one of them, at least. So, survivors, but shoot on sight lots. Don't feel like I need the battle rifle for these guys. Could just go over to something like a varmint rifle. That'd be fine. I say that, but I did kind of toss away my varmint rifle, so that ain't gonna work out. Fine. What's nice that doesn't use valuable ammunition? Honestly, service rifle probably. That seems pretty decent. And actually, I see a couple of them over there. Survivor. Another survivor. Fine. These guys seem soft and squishy. You've got yourself a revolver over there. Don't see a gun on you at all. And I think I saw another guy. Yeah, there's a guy in metal on the other side. He killed me last time. So, got to be a bit careful of you. But, potentially, from up here, might be able to pick off one or two of you. But, make sure you pick your target sensibly. There's no point picking someone who doesn't have a gun. If you've got one good shot before they realise you're here, take out the guy with the revolver. You appear to be unarmed, at least in terms of guns. Where's the gun users among ya? Ah, there's Captain Metal Armor. He's come for a stroll over here, and he's got himself a gun. Yeah, okay. Right, let's just loop around the outside here. Oh, he's coming this way. He is 100% coming. He's coming to investigate. He knows where I am. Go over to the good ammo. I might be able to get a surprise in on him while he's just round here. Alright, there he is. Hey. Oh! Or, or he'll realise where I am and immediately kill me! But, straight up, multiple shots in the head right now. Okay, what do I want to do? And what exactly are you armed with? Is that just a service? I think that's just a service rifle. Alright, go for the headshot and bit more. Okay, he's gone him down and does anyone else know where I am? I'm not sure they do. Oh, flip, no one else knows. What were you armed with? Yeah, service rifle. Right, get the service rifle, get the ammunition. That was intensive. Oh yeah, damage threshold 14, bloody hell, and a storm chaser. Right, I need to get out of here and not be close by to this corpse just in case they see it. Still, this gets me plus one damage in my own service rifle, which admittedly now has very little in the way of ammo. Still got 14 junk rounds though, that'll do. 
Alright. With that guy dead, potentially the rest of them are going to be softer pickings. The rest of them look much more squishy. He had that reinforced armour. Hang on, what's that? Yeah, that's where there's water. There's some water. There's a little pond over there in the base game. Question is, is it going to be there now? Alright. Keep it moving on. Where are the... Oh, I see you over there. And you all look, yeah, soft, squishy. That guy in particular, he's armed with a spoon. Oh, I see one of them over there, though. Down you go, my good man. I don't think you'll be causing me any more trouble. Good. One junk round, if it's a surprise, can kill these bastards. Keep an eye on them now. They might go and investigate that body. If they do, oh, I think that's exactly what he's doing. Are you coming to investigate that body? Because that works for me. No, he's coming out the front. Okay, that works for me. And just go for a couple of shots to you. What have you got, my good man? Shotgun. There he goes. He goes for that, and that means he has to reload. Nice. Reload that means I get a nice series of shots directly into his face. And back to hit him. Good. That works for me. All right. Where is he? Oh, another one. And I think they've started to spot the corpses. Take a shot. Missed. And now what have you got? That's a throw. She just threw something. No. And now she's run straight up to me. Good. And boom, boom, boom. Obviously that missed because the gun was technically sticking through her. Because that happens in this game. Oh dear. Right, I need to find something that's going to hit hard enough to kill. You've got a bump sword. You've got yourself uh, unarmed. Right, get up to her. That is that is doing nothing. That's doing... Okay, she's wearing good quality armour, unfortunately. Uh, I guess we just have to go for that and... Okay, that's ridiculous. Well, you can die at least. And then... Okay, seriously. You need to just stop chasing me and stop trying to punch me. How are we going to bloody deal with you? Right, well, you're going for a um, a nice melee fight right now. So how do you feel about block? And... Oh! What the... How did you just do that? How did you do that? Yeah, there we go. That's right. And now go in for a great big series of stabs. Because you may as well. It's free and she can't block it and then stab stab and then just stab some more and then go straight back to the block and then oh oh she's just broken my arm and she's she's actually beating me this is embarrassing this is just very embarrassing okay wait yeah come on come okay you have guns all right this is this is a non-issue okay if she's Representing this much of a problem, just shoot in face until no face. There you go. Problem has been solved. Bloody, oh yeah. Damage threshold 15 combat armor. That, that'd be why. Bloody hell. And love and hate, which is not that bad either. Damage 13 a blow. Ouch. Problem is it weighs 25, so I can't take it for myself. It just doesn't fly. Right, things I've still got. I've got a splint. Use that to restore my limb condition. I'm probably due for a tiny bit of food anyway, so just eat up a tiny bit. Uh, do myself a beer. And my... Oh. My armoured leather robes are literally at damage threshold 6 right now. 8 weight for damage threshold 6 is appalling. Fine, we need to swap them out for something. I mean, I could just dump them for now and... Yeah, for dump them for now, I could just wear the combat arm for the time being until I find something better. That'll do just for the minute, sure. And when I say that'll do for the minute, no. No, John. That math was totally flipping off. Right, well, I'm sitting on some stim packs right now. Ouch! I'm in bad shape. Right, do a double stim pack. Get some health going back here. I think we're now calm as we should be. Let's find myself some armor that I can actually flip and use. Because right now I'm naked and that's not good. Right, veteran outfit. That is exactly the same as what I just threw away. But it's light and it gives me strength plus one. So it is superior. Alright, Bonnie Springs. Honestly, 
I'm not sure there's much here I actually want. I don't think you can go inside any of the buildings. So mainly, I just want to, yeah, check the corpses and then just move on. Uh, I need to check all of the corpses. There should be, I think, a handful more than what I've checked so far. I've been over two there. I know there was another one around here somewhere. Nah, it looks to me like... Oh, hello. Hello. Get to high ground here. Get to flipping high ground. What is... Oh, Tunnler. Tunnler spawn. Oh, that's just marvellous. That's just marvellous. Get out the way, get out the way, get out the way, get out the way. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, multiple tunnel spawn. That might be a guaranteed spawn if you get too close to the town. But you two do rather conveniently seem to have got yourselves a little bit uh, stuck. So, how about we take advantage of that by just putting some nice explosives right on top of you bastards. That was apparently a critical hit. Great, and that also just freed them. So that that's not good. Right, continue spending ammunition. Oh, these things are just going to refuse to die, aren't they? They're going to be dicks about this. Yeah, head crippled. Venomous. Okay, just just go. Just hop off. Hop off. Then probably die of other things. Oh, bloody hell. Right, cling to the side of this rock face. If you cling to the side of this rock face, they probably... They might not be able to... No, no, they can Okay, this this entire adventure may have been a bad idea. How about we just stay as far away as possible from Bonnie Springs and say I have got no interest whatsoever in Bonnie Springs. I just want to skirt around the outside of it and... Okay, and then these guys just want to potentially attack me anyway because they're dicks. Maybe... Yeah, no. Ooh, hang on. A grave. I can open that. I don't want what's in it, but I can open it. Right, just just loop around the side here. Just see if you can just hop up the... Come on, 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 come on. They won't be able to follow you up here. Right, screw you. Screw you, bastards. I've no interest in fighting you. I'm very happy to just basically hide on top of this rock face. They'll never get to me up here. Right, okay. So, this this is certainly one solution. Absolute utter abject cowardice. Yeah, this is a good solution. I like this solution. We just stay on top of rocks that tunnelers will never be able to climb. For only I have the magical power of the jump button. And this leads to, yeah, that's going to lead up to the, the camp, isn't it? There's like the abandoned camp there. And over here somewhere, there might be a source of water. I'm just not 100% sure where because of the low visibility. Right, if I just loop round here at this point, can I loop round to the back of the campsite? I'm thirsty. Yes, I know. I'm, I'm working on it. I'm working on finding you some water right now. But if I can't find a way of working around multiple tunnelers that are blatantly hunting me, then we might be at a bit of a dead end here. Because, yeah, this, I believe, is the... This is the campsite. The little kind of... There we go. Back to hidden. Good, 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 good. Admittedly, yeah, the water supply is... Well, I say the water supply is never going to be available. But then again, the water that was outside Prim, that was unguarded. So, okay, yeah, that's, that's an NCR camp. Question is, how many? At least three. That's a no-go. Back off, back off, back off. Fine. So, the abandoned campgrounds, that's held by the NCR. Alright, but, if we could just, that looks like the first bit of dawn potentially coming up. I'm now suffering from beer withdrawal. Right, do some beer. Alright, I can't do with being thirsty and also not alcoholic enough. I've gained the day tripper perk. Excellent. You've done enough chems to know how to hang on to the effects just a little while longer. Ah, good! Well, that's marvellously good news. And, of course, it being New Vegas, yeah, those little custom perks that you get for just doing stuff do actually give you a tiny handful of XP as well. But in this mode, where there's no quests, every tiny handful of XP makes a big difference. Alright, we've got something that might work here. I've just got to work my way round two. What I'm hoping is... Okay. 
I'm increasingly suspicious there's guaranteed spawns and things with ludicrous perception here, and that might make this entire area not workable. And back into danger as well. Danger from... Ah! Danger from more tunnelers. And more tunnelers and more tunnelers and... Uh, okay, just try and cling to a rock face. Attempt to cling to rock face. Possibly tunnelers cannot get me if clinging to rock face. And that does look like water. Now... Tunnelers, like just about everything else, probably don't actually have an attack animation in the event of... Oh, I'm just going to fall and break my legs and die. That's what's going to happen here. I might have enough time to run to that rock, and maybe I'm safe on that rock. But... Where are they? Oh, it worries me I now do not know where the tunnelers are. Go, 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 put the gun away. The gun is irrelevant, the gun is irrelevant, the gun is irrelevant. I Oh, I can't climb this. I can't. Come on. Come on, jump button. Come on, jump button. Oh, dear. This is... This is... Okay, but I can get up here. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay. Where are they? There's water right there. Yeah, I know I feel thirsty. I'm aware. And... They're kind of coming this way, suggesting they can totally climb this. They can... They can totally climb this. Unless... Okay, I'm going to give this a go. Gonna give this a go here. I'm carrying all these explosives. I may as flipping well try and hit you stupid bastards. Might be able to take you out. I don't know. Venomous and just normal tunneler. Screw it. Give it a go. And that's a direct hit. That's some arms crippled right there. Right. They're on fire. And fire does make them panic. Ah, of course. Alright. That's, that's worth having a think about. Now they're stuck fleeing for a bit. Screw you all. Oh, that does nothing. That does absolutely flipping nothing. No. No, it does not. That has done naff all to you. I should have tossed it in and then made a run for the water. Maybe the water's safe. All right, give another go to the old dynamite plan. It's not going to do much, but... Eh, screw it. You know what? This is what explosives were made for. Tossing at tunnelers. And, oh, that's legs. One of them has crippled legs. Hang on, which one is it? Because if I could cripple the other one's legs, I might have... I can't tell because you can't target individual body parts. Boo. I mean, I'm going to guess it's you, given you're the weaker of the two. I mean, I've got one more explosive here. I've got the handmade, homemade... Oh, are you running right now? Where are you going? Where are you off to? Are you running away? You seem to be running away. I'm tempted to just make a run for the water. If I can make it to the water, I'm not safe, but I'll... Screw it, I'm making a run for the water. Go, 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 go. Make a run for the water, make a run for the water. No, they've decided to come back, they've decided to come back. Yeah, I've found the Spring Mountain Ranch State Park. And jump! Boom! Nice, water. It's not even that radioactive. And, like all creatures in this entire game, you bastards don't actually have any ability to attack me while I'm in the water. Except now there's... Okay. Now there's ants over there. Which is a concern. Alright. Now which way do I need to start running? I think it's over there, right? Yes, that way would logically lead me towards where I need to go if I'm making a run for the armory. Like, this is not gonna work. Not in a million years. But, if I make it over here, I might be able to get back on and behind some rocks. Like, you know, sooner rather than later. No! Should have figured they'd probably catch me. Oh, that's a completely different one as well. No, 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 and now I... Okay, this is just a no-go. Not yet. I don't have the guns for it. I cannot push through this way. Not this side, anyway. So what if, instead, already cleared out the actual town, we go to the other side of the town and see if maybe I can loop around the far side of the town because that armory would still be a really fun destination if I could get there. And I don't know if there might be... Well, this is not a great start. Also, apparently, there was someone else here. Right, okay, well, honestly, I'm, I'm happy to just let, you know, live and let live be the guiding principle, especially as you were armed with... Right, you're armed with a knife spear. 
honestly, I'm, I'm happy to just basically say you do you and I will do me. There you go. Bye. Right, okay. Now, this is, this is fire gecko territory in the base game. But I've also... Venomous tunnelers. Yeah, I saw a venomous tunneler in the distance. Uh, you already seen me. Yeah, you've already seen me. So that's good. And just basically use trees and rocks in an attempt to mess with their pathing if I'm on the run. And if I'm lucky, I might just be able to get out of your effective roam range before you're able to attack me. It's not desperately likely, and also sometimes when they stop to take a swing, they sometimes completely, uh, it just messes with their- Oh, there's more, there's more, there's more, there's more, there's more! And... Jump! Right, that'll probably mean they have to go around the long way. And then- No, it didn't, no it didn't, or rather the long way did not- No, this is just a no-go. There's too many flipping- And there's my destination as well. Boo. Alright, we'll try it. Just basically shove stim packs in yourself and, and hope. And then if I could just make it to that fence. No. Oh, look at that. There's... I've got... How many is that? Is that seven? I think that's seven. Right. Okay. No. That's, that's just not going to fly. All right. So basically what we've learnt is I've wasted a giant pile of ammo to get here. And here is a total flipping dead end of nothingness. Like, no more progress can be made in this direction. Absolutely flipping not. Unless I was willing to try and burn the stealth boy. But I don't know how far I'd get even with the stealth boy. It feels like that's way too far to actually make it to the armory or to the vaults. But if I could make it to one of those two, I could probably sneak in to the outskirts of Vegas, fiend territory in the base game. That wouldn't be bad, you know. That wouldn't be bad at all, if I could do it. Which I don't think I can, but I'm willing to give it a go. You know what? Gun away. Light armor. I'm invisible from the... Right! You guys are so perceptive, you're able of detecting me, even with a stealth boy. That's, that's how perceptive these bastards are. Right, and including, including, yeah. Okay, so even the final ace I was able to pull out of my sleeve was absolutely not going to fly. So in the end, all I've managed to do is waste a bunch of ammo and wreck my own armor and swap it out for, well, technically armor that's no worse than the old armor was when it was broken, but armor that's definitely, yeah, not as good as it was at full strength. That is, ow, weight 26. No, I think we can do without that. Any chance any of you have got anything good? No, damage threshold 3, that's total garbage. No. Alright, in which case... Ooh, unless I can... Where does that lead? Because that's leading up top. Just out of interest, what's going on up top? Because logically, going up top here and cutting southeast should bring me close by to the top of Quarry Junction. That should be roughly the area I'm in. And yep, there's the beer withdrawal again. Alright, and I'm going slightly mad from the beer withdrawal. Right, well this area is suspiciously quiet. Blimey, if you climb the cliffs right next to there. Oh, this is a bit of the map I do not know so well. Mainly is there's, there's just not much here. It's a pretty empty, uninteresting area. There's not much in the way of anything. Yeah, there we go. What I was expecting. So there's going to be Sloan. And that is going to be the quarry right there. And there's Black Mountain. So I'm just heading straight at the back corner of the quarry. Which I believe is still Deathclaw territory. Because I swear I saw a Deathclaw in the background at one point. Just slaughtering some cannibals, which works for me, because that means just for once, someone's slaughtering something that's not me. Now, if, I, however, I'm at the very top, I might be able to... Okay. Maybe we just head further up and away from the death claw. I don't know whether this path's going to work. It might bring me out towards where I want to go, which is, oh, that's, 
We all just saw movement over there, right? I did not just imagine that. I'm at least 70% confident I didn't. Into caution. And Deathclaw territory, that's no good. Deathclaws are fast and perceptive bastards. Come on, get up top here. Get up top, get out of their line of sight. Get as high as possible. And the rocks are glitching the hell out, which normally means you're in a part of the map the game isn't really expecting you to come and explore. All right, keep on going up. Being as high as possible very often stops them from tracking you. Oh, I'm officially in danger. The question is, oh, okay. We're into rads and invisible walls. Well, that's, that's a fascinating space to be in, isn't it? Right, what's casting the rads? And um, why they're invisible walls? Okay, I've got no choice but to come down. I've just hit a massive invisible wall. And I don't know what's hunting me. The music hasn't started playing. It might just be a generic dust storm. And... Flashing. I, I don't know. I mean, I'd guess... You know, one of them de- Oh, that means Pursuit is active. So, um, I've got nothing to try and do, aside from just cripple a leg. Alright, I'm going for a leg cripple, and I did not get the leg cripple. So, this is, I'm going to go for a leg cripple again, and no, except, oh, uh, okay, can we, can we maybe like not, ooh, that might have just accidentally worked. How well can you follow me up here? Okay, what if I drop down over here? Okay, now you sort of can't follow me. Go, 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 go. Oh, no, there's another one. There's another one. I'm just choosing which and also a third. Okay. I've decided this is not the right way to go. But you know what? Chin up. This is not a disaster. Not at all. I got up to level three. That got me an extra 15 carry capacity. That's good. That is very much good just on its own. All right, I've fallen back to good springs. It's time to go for what we already know is the most sensible plan. The most sensible plan is simply to try and skirt around the outside of Sloane and from Sloane try and get through Black Mountain without disturbing the NCR and get down to the south of the map that way. Once we're down the south of the map, we know where there is at least one source of water, though it is guarded by a giant pile of the actual bastard tunnelers. So it's not exactly great, but it's the best plan we've got. While I'm here though, I'm up to 150 tiredness, I may as well catch just like three hours sleep in Easy Pete's bed, just for the sake of getting rid of that, Though that is going to make me a lot more thirsty, but I don't know when I'm next going to have the opportunity. Well, actually, I've got the bedroll now, so I can actually just sleep anywhere. But, while I've got a nice bed, I feel like, you know, I may as well use it. Enjoy a nice bit of sleep while I have the chance, because this is a nice indoor double bed. I don't need much. Three hours should be absolutely fine just to keep me ticking over. Yeah, there we are. Sleep down to 23. I got that calculation about right. Food, 178. Water is getting out of hand. Sleeping is a very, very thirst-making activity. All right. Am I completely out of water at this point? I've got, I've got one dirty water. I'm going to take that, and I'm going to do just... Yeah, there we go. There's the day tripper perk again. Fine. So I've got that back at this point. Lovely. So, I've got myself a fair bit of water down there. Down to 251. How much does beer do? Only minus 36. I should hold off on that for the time being. But I am seriously lacking in. Well, I may as well eat the dog steaks too, quite frankly. I mean, food's 114. Let's just make sure that doesn't get out of hand. Right. I'm running low on food. Got some iguana bits there. Fine. They're good, but... An iguana on a stick is really good. Alright. Now, that's definitely not human. Because it clearly looks like an iguana. Alright, no matter what anyone says, this iguana stick is not human, even if the iguana bits might be. Right, 
nice green day. Visibility not great, but the comments did say that, yeah, rad storms weren't a thing inside dust. They were not introduced, so we don't have to worry about that. It's just a rather interesting visual effect, but that's fine. If I just step inside and outside again, the sky will probably turn lime green or something. Now, need to head down here and then make a break for slow. I need to stick to the far left of the road because otherwise, yeah, there'll be a couple of people in camps that'll see me and cause trouble. I want to get to the outskirts of slow without being spotted at all. Perfect world, I do not need to burn my stealth boy but I might need to just to make this run nice and smooth. Oh, into caution. And I hear somebody shooting at something. And I see what looks like is that a dead tunneler down there. Ah, that's the tunneler I killed, in fact. Yes. That is... I think I just saw a person over there for a second. I assume that was you taking a pot shot at some wildlife. All right. Leave all that be for the time being. Now I should be... Yeah, I should be fine for the minute. I can run as far as that caravan because I've already cleared all of that out. So this stretch of road is safe. But when I go past this caravan and I don't turn off to the... Or... Or not. Hello. You two are having a bit of a barney. And I kind of hope the melee lad wins. The melee lad did not win. Uh, who are you? That was a survivor who just killed... Actually, you know what? This works for me. If you would just like to... Oh, no, 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 no. Don't see me. Don't see me. Because you've got a shotgun and you just killed someone. So if you'd like to... Ah, uh, fine. I'll see if I can just pick you off. And the answer is... No. No. I think you just dived out of the way at just the wrong flipping moment as well. Uh, you've got a shotgun, actually. If I just basically get round here and just keep the caravan between me and her, use the third-person camera to actually track where she's got herself to. Yeah, there we go. Let her fire. There we go. And you've got yourself a single shotgun, which means you are struggling with... Get close to it. No, that's too close. The gun will go through her face. That's about close enough. <laughs> that's just right. There we go. Should have actually gone over to something that wasn't the service rifle. Yeah, that doesn't actually work because, unfortunately, that's all right, but I've already got one of them. Her head goes for a roll. Do I actually want to go over back to a shotgun? Like, I think I've got a little bit of ammo for the shotgun. No. I don't really have the, the space for it. I need to just use up some of this ammo and then toss these guns. Now, you also had a Barney with someone. It was presumably one of these two. And you had... Not much. All right. Bit of a shame. Wait, eight. Oh, yeah, hang on. Check everyone's armor. I might want to take one of your sets of armor, potentially. Because right now I'm wearing... What is it? Yeah, weight eight, damage threshold six. So that is even worse. Great. Everyone loves even flipping worse. Well, that is five to seven. Just standard leather armor. Boring as hell, but it does actually just give me a tiny bit more protection. One less strength, though. One extra strength is nice. Yeah. Keep that for the time being. Also, I pressed X because I meant to drop, but that's not what X does in this menu. X in this menu takes all. Right, number one, the 45 pistol. Just grab that, use that up, toss it away. Because I could definitely do with getting rid of that. And also, ooh, that's an extra bobby pin. And a combat knife. Alright, uh, that's not even that bad. I'll take that. That's that's eight and eight. But again, I don't have the no. I'll I'll keep the strength. I probably shouldn't. This feels like a bad decision, but for now I'll keep the strength. Right. Let's head up to Sloan. Stay on the left. Just seeing if I can stay out of trouble. Now, yeah. Coming up in the base game, there's a family of coyotes in the... What's that? It's just a sign. That's fine. I thought it was a Securitron there. Uh, there's a family of coyotes in the back of a truck. This mod often seems to say, if coyote, then Night Stalker. So, there's a possibility 
the we're gonna have to work around some night stalkers hopefully we can just avoid that hopefully they're just not there at all oh I see you bastards yeah I want to stick away from these guys this is what I want to avoid I don't want to fight with them let's just see if I can just hop up here get around the back of them because I want to keep my distance from you oh but that's caution though that's a caution. Is that caution you're heading my way or is it something else? It might be something else. Maybe just pause in a second and... No, that's another sign. Back to hidden. Good. Good, 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 good. That's what I needed to say. Except hanging. Is that something moving down there? Is that movement or is that... I don't think it is. I think we're okay. Good. Well, most of the way to Sloan. No trouble so far. I say, as I start suffering from beer withdrawal, and somebody starts firing guns at something. But, I don't know what any of these problems are, so... Alright, not my issue. Right, do another beer just to keep water ticking down, and also to avoid the problems of withdrawal. You know, I'd love nothing more than to bring a death claw up into Sloan. I would absolutely love to do that. Because, yeah, they would tear each other apart. Whether I can put... Oh, I'm closer to Sloan than I thought I was going to be. Right. Keep my distance. Loop round down here. And, yeah, I'm heading for that path up there. If I can do this without a stealth boy, that would be marvellous. But there is no shame in using a stealth boy if I have to. Because I feel like that's going to be by far the safest way. And, hello... What's that? That is... That's ah, just a person. But I feel like I've gone the right route here. Yeah, this feels like a good route. I think I can just cut through up there towards Black Mountain. We should hopefully be alright. Alright. Skirting around the edge of these bastards. They haven't seen me yet. Now, I'm not actually sure what's going to be up this slope. Could be any number of bad things that also want me dead. But... It might... Just might work. Alright, oh! Feral. That's not bad. Ferals are alright. Alright, one bullet, one headshot, feral dead. Uh, especially if it's only one. If they're coming at me one at a time, yeah, fine. And boom! Is that the... Not quite! And that's the moment. Boom. Dead. Bye. Alright, so now I'm coming up the... I'm coming up the... Is this now the other side of the edge of... Yeah, this is now the other side of the edge of Hidden Valley. The side that's the far side from... Oh, hello. Right, are you actually trying to, to hunt me down at this point? And can you even do it? I'm not sure you can. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Okay. Right, now I know where I am then. Alright, well this is going to be intriguing. Question is, can I just get up to a high spot? They can't follow me. So I'm kind of hoping that might be exactly what I can do. Yes. I mean, I don't see him. I don't see him hunting me particularly effectively. And we're out of the rads too. Yeah. This will do. They're all over there. They're all over there right now. I need them to, like, run way over there or something. So I can just basically hop down here, kill that guy, and make a run straight for Hidden Valley. That would work. Or I could just go this way and now just loop in round here. That could work too. Let me see this. Ah, now there's a bloody... There's a bloody conga line of them. That's a lot of ghouls to kill. Right, yeah. You guys see me and then like naff off somewhere else. That's like not... Hi oh, bloody hell. Right, now, now there's a party. So, what are we going to do to you bastards? Well, actually, if you want to just run over there, then see our camp is somewhere in that direction. And now, weirdly, we're to caution. All right, what if I just head in this direction? Stay on the high ground. I don't think they can get up to me over here. Yeah, that's that's all fine. But does your pathing allow you to find a route? Because I'm not sure it actually does. And now we are... Yeah, now we're in the high area above, round here. Now, if I could just potentially lead these ghouls towards the cannibals, 
then my two problems could solve each other. That would be very bloody convenient. The question is, are they going to actually pull it off? No, I don't think they will. I'm not sure they can they can roam effectively. Do I have any garbage ammo I don't need? If I've just got some garbage ammo I want to get rid of, admittedly, yeah, that doesn't really... Not really a thing so much in this game. But, okay, what have I got, like, loads of junk rounds? Oh, blow me! I'm sitting in all the junk rounds in the world for 357. All right. Well, let's just do the world's slowest reload. Hello! We're... Yeah, no, 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 no! No, not over there! Over here! Over here! You want to come over here? And, no, not actually climb up to me. Just, like, run alongside towards Sloan. You want to run towards Sloan. That's where you want to run. Admitted, if you want to just now naff off. Right, I think I might have accidentally just cleared a path for myself there. Because now, yeah. Now I'm back to Hidden. Now they're all over there. They're going back to Hidden Valley. Those bastards hopefully won't see me. Oh, blimey! I think I've accidentally just made a path for myself. Lovely. Now. Right now, I'm stuck directly between Deathclaws, Cannibals, and a giant conga line of ghouls. So none of that is good stuff. None of it. But if I get the angle just right, I might be able to avoid all three of these. Yep, there's the... Yeah, 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 I know where you are. I know you're there. Right around here. Drop down here. Into the house. Good. Good, 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 good. Any chance there's like a... I'll have a beer as well. Life just gets better and better. A spacious, I'm literally just started suffering from beer withdrawal. Well, it's good that I just found this random beer. Now, what have we got? Oh, that'll probably be the NCR. Yeah, there's a death claw. That'll probably be the NCR in the NCR camp over there, firing at a feral. So I need to stay low enough that the death claws do not detect me. I need to, however, stay over in this direction, so the NCR don't detect me. There might be a pile of ghouls at one of the roadblocks, so I need to make sure... Ooh, where do I want to go now? This feels dangerous, but this means the NCR won't see me. I don't see any... No movement over on that side, so the death claws aren't going to see me. Next, I just need to climb up here. Earliest opportunity, I just need to now climb up here... And then stick on the high ground and make my way round to the point where I can just climb through the nice, convenient way through. Alright, and this is just about working. Good. There we go. Can't see the NCR, which probably means the NCR hopefully can't see me. And I've already done a practice run of this area. So I know once I'm up top, I should be safe. Nice! Spot on. Exactly what I do in the base game. Brilliant. Just out of interest, mind. No. No Black Mountain radio. Fine. So there's definitely uh, no mutants up there still broadcasting a radio signal. Right. Stay over here. And I'm now midway between, I believe, big old pile of, yeah, ghouls on one side. And a big old pile of death claws the other. Now I'll have no choice but to come down onto the road ahead. But... The area looks clear. I think we're good. Should be nice and quiet. Alright, lovely and quiet. And no sign of any nightkin. I didn't see any nightkin last time I was passing through, but you know what? There's a nightkin here in the base game, and there's the ghouls over there. There's a big old pile of them, but you can just bypass them by climbing up the ridge. Right, and that is... That's just a hole in the road. And this is an NCR person that presumably went scouting. So, time to just deal with all of this. Grab this, grab your rounds. No, I can deal without that, but I'll take a rat away. Thank you very, very much indeed. So, yeah, there is the noise of rocks falling. Stay way back over here. There we go. Watch out for the traps. And wait for the big noise. There it is. Big noise. Giant rolly rock. 
stay well back off to one side. Weirdly, it doesn't actually trigger any of the actual, uh, yeah, doesn't trigger any of the traps it rolls over, but what have you. I'm pretty sure I can't do anything with these myself. No, repair 45 required to disarm those bastards. So I'll just work around the outside of them. Watch out for more. No, I think we're good. And we are through the mountain range. Welcome to the north of the map. Beautiful. Now I know for a fact that I can drop straight down and go into the NCR safe house. But until I've got lockpick 50, there's no way of accessing it. But definitely remember that's there. Together with remembering this isn't a terrible way to get back to Hidden Valley when I need to revisit that. Because there's a bunch of doors there that were average and hard locked. I feel like potentially that could be something of interest. Though if I go this way actually, just realise what I'm quite close to in fact. With the rest stop being around there, that would actually put, yeah, the Repcon headquarters around here. Now that is, for the most part, pretty friendly robots. I mean, I wouldn't bet money on it still being pretty friendly robots, but it's worth a look. If nothing else, there's a bunch of skill books in there. I mean, we can also have a little look see at the 188 uh, little checkpoint, but yeah, that's going to be either NCR or Cannibals, if I had to guess. So I feel like that's not a good spot. Also, I'm hungry, and hunger is a real problem because hunger is strength down, and strength down is carry capacity. How much food do I have left? Because I'm getting, I'm getting worryingly low. Do another beer. Uh, you know what? Eat both the iguana bits right now and screw it. Let's just go all in on the iguana. I mean, on the plus side, rads are not a problem right now. Rads are not a problem in the flipping slightest because I'm doing so much boost. That's keeping my sanity up and it's keeping my rads down. This is the secret to my survival. Alcoholism. Yay! Oh, that's... That's not water, is it? That's just a weirdly shiny bit of ground. I'd like it if it was... No. Sadly, I cannot drink that, boo. I mean, it's... It's making a bubbly noise. Oh, is this tar? Yes, definitely don't drink that then. Alright, here we go. So, that's a Poseidon Energy Garage right there. Get up top. Have a look around. There she is. Right, well. This is all of interest. Right, let's just start looting these two buildings here. I can't remember if you're even allowed inside that size, and I'm pretty sure that's just door nailed shut. Nothing to be got, but there might be a sarsaparilla machine. There's a sarsaparilla machine that's... Hello? Somebody just murdered two people. Question is, who just done it? Because those two people were cut down in seconds, and I'd like to know... Who's the local power? Because I'm guessing... Survivor. Ah! Fine. Survivor who's now weak. One bullet will take care of you, my good man. And then I've got three corpses. Yeah, that's got to be a good deal. And... Ah, darn it. I was hoping we'd just hit you there. Where are you running? You're running... You're running away from me. All right. Sham, I didn't quite get the hit in there. Let's go over to the 45. Back to hit him. Let's just loop around the back of this here garage. See if we can just persuade him to come to me when the time comes. Alright, 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 alright. Yeah, there we go. There we go. That's right. That's flipping right. So just third person it. And... Where's he? There we go. We can just get ourselves... Hello! Come on, you must... How do you not know I'm there? Yep, yeah, there you go. Right, now just let him run around the corner and then we'll just get him straight in the head. And wait, 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 wait. Boom! And now we can just take whatever the easiest shot is, which weirdly is the arm. I'll take an arm shot there. Boom! He got maybe one shot in, but I didn't even feel it. He might have missed. Right, so... 9mm, 9mm junk, makeshift submachine gun. Weighs 3, uses 9mm, that's an absolute no. Morphine, yeah. Other than that, 
Actually, that's damage threshold 7 for only weight 6. But again, I'd rather have the plus 1 strength just for the time being. And you, my good man, killed two people. So I'll just be having their bodies too. So I get three corpses for the price of one bullet, which works for me. Aside from the fact that that's garbage. And that's not. That's six bullets. Nice. Old NCR armor and a volcanic pistol. All right. That does, actually, that's of interest. Damage 16 versus, hang on, versus damage 14. All right, let me have a little look see at that thing. Because, yeah, I found one of these in my first little playthrough, didn't I? Uh, I can't remember where from exactly. Damage 16. Ah, yes, this is the, uh, this is the only contains... Oh, I thought it contained only one bullet. But, no, it contains eight. Well, it seems to just be a more powerful variant of... Uh, yeah, that's... Oh, but now that's damage 12. Because it's... Ah, yeah, if you actually compare like for like, that's damage. That's damage. No, it is better. It is actually better. Damage 10 versus damage 12. All right. We'll give this old girl a go. Put her over to junk rounds. Junk rounds 12 damage. Not bad at all. All right. Here's the big one. Repcom. If I can get in here and loot it, there is energy weapons, energy ammo... And, in addition, a bunch of skill books for energy. Now, the problem is, the maintenance robots are showing up as not friendly. So, in the base game, they just circle around in a friendly fashion. Alright. Have they changed their minds by any... Oh, they've changed their minds. Yes. Yes. Okay, but do you actually have any guns? Because if you've only got the spinny whirly blades, then... Alright. May as well make a run inside. But, oh, the tour guides. The tour guides are going to be... Yes. Or maybe not. No! The tour guide is fine. Right, save me, tour guide. Potentially there's some of your brethren coming to try and murder me. Please don't... Ah! 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 No, you're friendly. Okay. We might actually be okay. Because here's the fun thing. There's also a giant pile of corpses in here. And a giant pile of corpses might just actually get me some useful bits and pieces. Alright, that's fire resistance. War club's not great. Ah, it's just tribals. They're not great. Throwing hatchets. They weigh two each. No do damage 22. Sun at throwing weapon. Tomahawk is 22. At least it's a little bit on the lighter side. I may as well take that. Yeah, knife, scorpion poison. I'll take a throwing spear as well, and that's not very good. Right. It's possible they forgot to turn all these robots into hostile mode. And if they did... Oh, there's toilets. Ouch. 16 rads. That's very radioactive. But, bare minimum, do we even have any... No, please don't speak to me. It makes me very nervous. Any chance anyone is? No, they're all as radioactive as each other. And we've got no actual, uh, no, nothing in the way of, ooh, but, no, that is not actually food. Right, stay away from the rad barrels. Check through here. What do we got? Yeah, that's hard locked, but there's some good stuff there. Well, I can do some looting here. The question is, is any of this looting going to be worth it to me? Because this is all fairly generic loot so far. All right. Well, let's see if we can go and get Mrs. Miggins uh, ID card from around the rear. And also make sure none of this has been replaced by actually angry versions. No, I need lockpick of 50. Right, with lockpick of 50, or rather without it, that means I don't have advanced dehydration. I need to get water fast. I'm not sure this trip's going to be worth it. That's average. That's... Well, this is embarrassing. Apparently, I can't actually do anything here. Dear, oh, flippin' dear. Is any of this any good? And the answer is no. Right, so... I do have a, a source of water. Alright, I could just actually drink out of the urinal or the toilet. Okay, I'm gonna do it. And there we go. Because the thing is, while I'm gaining a bunch of rads... 
just basically holding down A in front of a water source drains your, like, water immediately down to, like, zero. So, even with all that, how many rads just pick up? Yeah, 47 rads. Like, that's a good deal. Toilets are actually a really good source of water, arguably a little bit too generous. So, even if I can't make any more progress here yet, that's still worth it. And remember to come back here, because this is interesting. The fact that this place appears to actually have friendly robots. Apart from outside, but hopefully those guys, they probably do have blasters. They probably just didn't have a shot. I'm just going to be shot to ribbons by plasma as I try and run, aren't I? Oh, probably, yes. And... Wait, do you actually have a blaster? You... Might, but you don't seem interested in using it. Good, 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 good. Actually, I wonder if I could... Could I by any chance lead you guys somewhere useful? Like, at some point are you going to give up? You don't seem to be catching up with me. Right, well, I'm just going to lead these guys back to the 188 trade post. See if by any chance... Oh, I'm leading all three of them. Right. Now, this, this is of interest right here. Like, maybe if you guys would like to just come over here and help me with my enemies. That's right. Keep on coming. Everybody keep on coming. <laughs> Okay, so it should be around here somewhere. And what is ahead of me? Survivor? Survivor. Okay, let him get nice and close. Let him get nice and close to me. Hello? No, 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 no. Keep coming. Keep coming. Oh, gosh darn it. Have you reached the edge of your effective... Ouch! Have you guys reached the edge of your effective roam range? Uh, right, okay. Guys, 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 guys. There's... Oh, hang on. One of you's got a Brahmin. These guys are being marked in yellow, not red. Oh, flip. Right, guns away, guns away, guns away. No, 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 I'm fine. But if you want to take out those crazy robots that are following me, that's great. They're not shooting me. Have I just found an actual trader? Hello? I want to be friends. Would you like to be friends? Because I would love, just like so much, to be friends. Friends would be the best thing. They haven't turned and pointed guns at me yet. This is this is all marvellously good. So they are getting a bit spread out. I might have just screwed up your entire company. Right, guys, I'm going to speak to you one by one now. What do you need? You're a mercenary. Okay, so logically you are protecting a trade caravan. The question is, which one of them's the, the actual, you know caravan bit of the caravan are you just all friends and like you know your possessions are being oh are you guys hunting down robots right now because if you are i'm happy to help and that guy's being set on fire oh i think i found the only friendly people in the entire wasteland and they're about to be murdered yeah right go dead and that is two dead yeah you know what me and you we can all be friends together dead dead. Stop it. Don't set them on fire. How many of them just died? Two. Right. So, yeah, they were probably friendly, weren't they? Yes, yes, they were. And and now they're dead. Still, there's two of them alive, except now they're all separated from... Ooh, hunting shotgun. Hello, sexy. That is... That's powerful stuff. That's leather armor. All right. I'll take a hunting shotgun off this guy's corpse, and... What have you just found? Hello? Right, well, I don't know. And you've got yourself... Ooh. Alright, extra rounds here. Expensive. Really expensive, but... I'll take this. You know what? Me and you, I'm very happy to travel with you. Is there any chance you're willing to chat to me and be, like, mean? super friends? No. Later. Sadly, they do not want to be friends. But if they'd like to be bullet sponges, that works. Oh, hello. What's that over there? There's... Well, you're walking into something. You are walking into something. And whatever it is, quite frankly, if you want to deal with it rather than me, I'm willing to provide backup fire. Because right now, we're actually very close by to that source of water. All right, we're almost back there. Beyond the bridge, we're getting there. I'm not sure you're heading in that direction. 
And I'm also not sure where the fourth member of your company ended up, but whatever, eh? Shotguns. Shotguns, shotguns, shotguns. How much ammunition do I have for this thing? Barely any. I may as well use it up and then toss it away. Just because that is not going to fly. But, if you're looking for a new bodyguard, then I'm more than happy to join up. Though, you're not heading down the road. You're heading towards... Right, no you are. You are, and that there is... Dead Survivor. 10mm ammo. 125 and a Brahmin stake. Right. I think we might have just found what would have been a trader, so that's a shame. Still, I get some Brahmin meat and all the rest of it from that. And she doesn't seem to mind the fact that I'm just looting the dead. Alright. Yeah, that over there is the little train stop area where Veronica's story ends. I think me and the survivor can be friends for the time being. Right now, I'm happy to join this convoy. In fact, I'm now very sad I lured the robots over to kill you. Because if I hadn't done that, right now, I'd have a convoy of, like, four people that I could just travel around with. And that would basically, potentially, be a private army I could have thrown the tunnelers at. So basically what I'm saying is, I'm sorry I threw robots at you. Because if I hadn't done that, I could have thrown tunnelers at you. So, yeah, it's possible I'm the bad guy here. Is there any sign of the fourth one? No. He's, he's fallen miles behind wherever he is. Right. And the nice thing is, she'll become aware of any enemies. So, in the event of... Yeah, there it is. That's the tower where Veronica's actual quest comes to an end, if you try and resolve it by having her join the followers of the apocalypse. Yeah, it's just beyond this bridge. This is where I've actually been before. That's the long bridge. There is a spawn point for... Right. Yes. No. If I had to guess, and if I was feeling optimistic, that might be the guys who start over there trying to take out tunnelers and quite possibly failing. Honestly, if they do fail, that's fine. Do I have any more? Ooh, I've got seven junk. Yes, yeah, screw it. Go over to junk. Because shotguns do at least work fairly well against zero damage threshold enemies. And tunnelers are precisely that. If I could have one weapon that would be great against a tunneler, yeah, this would actually be it. Powerful hunting shotgun. Well, I've deliberately depowered it slightly, but screw it, it'll do. And uh, yeah, fourth member of your company is just not here. Now, over on the right, we've got water. Question is, are the tunnels already there? And if they're not, are the raiders still there? And if the raiders are still there, are they just going to kill this woman? Yeah, okay, so we're straight into violence. He is shooting at her, not me, which works for me. And boom! 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 Down he goes. Is she dead? Right, she's dead. And also I feel tired. And now... I'm back to hit him. Okay, so the convoy is now dead. Alright. But, money, water, food. Alright. And also, yeah, some not bad stuff there. She was never going to last long. She didn't have the damage threshold. And I am really sorry. So, so sorry. By which I mean not sorry at all. But you are... Oh, hang on. Is that the fourth member of your company? Has he managed to catch up? It is as well. <laughs> okay. So, you're going to see a lot of corpses of your friends. And you're going to see me with a shotgun. But I would like to reassure you, none of that was me. I wanted it to happen, but I was not actively responsible. Now, this does present one problem, which is I don't want to shoot the cow anymore, because if I shoot the cow, he's probably going to object to that. And I'm not sure if the cow's going to follow him. I would really like to kill that cow, because Brahmin steak is a very good healing and food item, and food is getting a bit on the low side. And yeah, water is interesting. Water is in very, very low amounts. But if you can just find one actual source of water you can drink from, you can basically drain your entire thirst meter down to zero in 
a second just by holding A in front of it. So even if it happens to be the most heavily irradiated water in the entire world, you barely take any rads regardless. Now, question is, no. The cow was following her. You, my good man, are wearing... Is that reinforced leather? That might be nice. I wouldn't mind some of that. And also, is that... No, that's a rock. Not a person. I would like to drain my thirst here. I'd also like to search both of these houses and help myself to everything here. But I've been here before. And I know we are dangerously close. No, no, that's, that's not the... Okay. That's, yeah, there you go. Just, just turn right here. There you go. Whatever's here, he'll hopefully trigger it. I want to say hopefully. I don't really want the tunnelers to swarm in. Perfect world, they actually wouldn't. In fact, last time I was here, didn't the tunnels get triggered by someone being, ouch, beer withdrawal, by someone being over there? If we just stay away, we might be alright. Yeah. I mean, I don't see any movement over there. Oh, I need booze, though. I need booze, otherwise I can't keep walking. Although, if I just actually merge these two together. There we go. That'll do, though. Oh, that's my last beer. Oh. Oh, no. I'm, I'm out of beer. There's no good at all. Oh, you've got leather armor reinforced. Ooh. Okay. That's... That's good. Weighs 10, though. Weighs 10. Is that is that two more than what I've got right now? That is... Yeah, that's two more. Yeah, take it, because this guy's going to die sooner or later. So let's just swap that over. And I'm still okay to keep walking. Just. Okay, so that shack has actually been closed up. There was someone here. They're dead now. Right, so this was a survivor camp. It already wasn't a shop, so it was never going to function as a shop. It's a dead dog here. I do not see movement. I see some moonshine. Turn off the radio. Let's not draw attention to ourselves. More dead dogs. Something has cleared these bastards out. And it wasn't me. I don't think it was flipping tunnelers. And then... Oh, uh-oh. Uh uh-oh. 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 Wait, what? Excuse me. Um, I may just have drawn bad attention. Like, really bad attention. I'm in danger right now. And it's... It's from... Yeah, okay. If you want to how many... Oh, there's several. There are several. There are several. Go for the double headshot. Boom. Right, there we go. Crippled and... Dead. Okay, there's another one, there's another one, there's another one. Reload, 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 reload. Okay, and I'm also suffering from the effects of poison right now, I think. Yeah, poison, hit points minus five. Right, well, I've got plenty of anti-venom. Do that. Do a bandage. Screw it. Do a stake and do a stim pack. And I need you to be tanking for me, but I can help. All right. Oh, no. Oh, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I think his legs are already in trouble, actually. Okay. Right. I've crippled a right arm. I need to go over to the most powerful thing I've got. Ideally, that's actually got flipping, you know, ammunition in it. Uh, and when I say... I've not got much in the way of ammunition. Right. Tomahawks. And go. There you go. And there we go. Uh-oh. This is... This is less good. Right, just toss this, toss this, toss this, toss this, toss this. See if we can just scare him off. See if we can scare him off. That's fire. That's fire. That spooks you, you stupid bastard. Right, okay. That should have done some damage to them. The fire damage might finish off one of them. I need to... Uh, I think that actually broke one of my limbs. Okay, I need to splint up and do a scroll on a stick. Because screw it, I shouldn't have done that. My food's got to be... Yeah, my food's fine. I should have just done another stim pack there. In fact, yeah, let's just let's just do that. I'm basically at the point where just a single scratch will cripple me. Okay. Can I do this? I don't know. Go over to yeah, go over to volcanic and reload it with junk. Now, are those guys still gonna be around and going for me? They're coming back. There's one. 
Okay, that's that's not so bad. And there we go. And okay, are your legs crippled right now? I think there might be, you know. I think I might have crippled your legs, you stupid bastards. There we go. And boom. Finish it off. Yeah, finish it. Oh my goodness. Are we actually back to... We're back to... Oh, well, of course. Obviously, I was only in hidden for two fractions of a second. Now somebody wants to kill me again. Have I actually just cleared out the... How many did I see the first time I was here? I mean, I was running away from them. So, I don't really know for certain. Tunnel of me. Okay. I mean, I can try and cook it. I don't know how well it's going to be... You know, on the old taste buds. But I need to come back anyway. Because I need... That's hide. I need your everything. Dirty... Ooh, dirty bomb. That's fascinating. And your arm is not even in terrible condition. Nice. Actually, that's only damage threshold 8 even once repaired. My repair skill's not great. That's no good at all. Right, well... Screw it. Do a whiskey. And... There's the cow. The cow doesn't seem to be running, which is, you know, probably a good sign. This volcanic pistol's almost broken. I can't see anything apart from that cow. I'm really hoping I just cleared these bastards out and now I've got access to water. Because I might, just might, have access to a supply of water this side of the map. Assuming nothing now just runs out of... I should not have said assuming at that point. I shouldn't. That was a mistake. Where are you? 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 And can I use this fence against you? What? What is coming for me? What's coming for me? Because things seem to detect you from 10 bajillion. Screw it. I'm just going for a drink. Yeah, there we go. Uh, right, have a quick sip. What is it? What's coming for me? Yeah, I figured it might be, you stupid bastard. Okay, take a couple of headshots and then jump over the top. And boom, boom, right now. Oh, my weapon just broke. And now just jump over the top. Okay, oh no, 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 you bust. What the hell was that? Right, okay, so sadly Tunnel of Superman showed up. And, and, okay. There were more tunnelers yet. And also two more at the back. Right, at least four more. You know what, ladies and gentlemen, I have decided I am just not going to go over there. I'm not going to risk activating any of those bastards, given there are, yeah, with three dead and four more remaining, there's at least seven tunnelers that can activate around that area. And for me, that's a good reason to never go over there. Admitting I did just go over there, but that was only so I could activate the area and, you know, get the goods off that... Right, I think I just activated them. Oh dear. How many have we just activated? No, we're just in caution. It's fine. Everything's fine. They're definitely not coming for us. They're definitely not coming for us. I think me and this guy might be onto a good thing. I think me and him might just head down south and see what we can find together. Because him in all his beautiful armour, I think this is going to work out just flipping fine. Next time, ladies and gentlemen... I'm going to go for a little stroll close by to Vegas itself. The outskirts, maybe even as far as Freeside, see what is going on. Although, actually, this guy, this guy's going to die first. This guy is definitely going to die first. So, Steve here might not be joining us for that, ladies and gentlemen. Quite possibly not, but who knows? You never flipping know. <laughs> Hopefully, you'll join me for that. But in the meantime, I've been John. This has been many a true nerd. And this has been Fallout New Vegas with Dust. Thank you very much, and goodbye. And, oh, how's Steve? No, Steve's fine. Steve's okay for the time being. Wait, did people just vote out democracy? Hang on, what have you just done? Oh, go on, let's have the greatest Oktoberfest ever. Yay! Spain and Russia announced a new alliance as a result of the warmongering of certain Central European countries. Oh, well, excuse me! My leader from now on, no weeklings will stand in the way of this country's path to glory. Oh god, Germany, not again!